what was it like when you first took over the ball club uh, when they let Clint Hurdle go? Well, I'll tell you what, Rob, bittersweet. Uh, initially, as a matter of fact, I can, I can remember uh, the, back on the 29th of May uh, when I had to walk into that clubhouse. I think the only day that I've had that was, what was maybe as tough or tougher uh, probably was the, the trading deadline deal when we lost uh, LaDuca, Moda, and Encarnacion in, in, in 2004 in Los Angeles. So, you know, bittersweet from that standpoint. And also, really, Rob, the uncertainty of, you know, exactly where was this all going to go? Because Danny, Danny O'Dowd, if he were here with us, sitting here with us talking about this, would tell you this, that uh, after I had a get-together with him uh, at, at, at the apartment that my wife and I were staying at in Denver, uh, when he was finished with his conversation with me, I, I didn't immediately accept, Rob. I, I said to Danny, I said, can I have 60 minutes to think about this? And he said, yeah, you can have 60, but you can't have 61 because i got to have somebody down in that dugout uh, uh, to manage tonight. But the one thing that he said uh, during the course of our about an hour and a half conversation that I held on to uh, was the fact that, you know, he felt very strongly, and he told me this. He says, I really believe I've put a better team together than what we've been watching here for two months. He said, I have no expectations on you. I would just like to see this team play a little bit better. Uh, and little did I know, uh, you know, the thing I had to come to grips with was could I make it play a little bit better, but I had no idea it would play to the tune of 74 and 42. Obviously, that would have been an absolute ridiculous thought. But bottom line is it, it, it's a good team, and it's a team that I've strongly encouraged to realize where they were back in 2007, where they've gotten back to again, and, and, and don't run into the wall uh, and lose your identity. It's, it's something that we need to embrace and keep surging forward because, uh, you know, the, the athleticism and the youth that we have on this club and the opportunity, obviously, to add a Jeff Francis back into a rotation that won 17 games back in 2007, uh, I feel really strong. As a matter of fact, I'm going to be very adamant about the fact that we don't disappear. We keep knocking on that same door. we got a chance to go through, and hopefully we'll play the last game of the year and win.